Back here on 10 Tampa Bay this evening, Jackson Orwitz alongside Courtney Robinson. Uh, so we're in March now, which is typically the start of Florida's fire season. Hot, dry weather until we finally get the rain back around May. Hillsborough County Fire Rescue just added four new trucks to their fleet designed to attack those brush fires before they get out of control. 10 Tampa Bay's Eric Glasser takes a look at the county's new fleet of Skeeter trucks and what makes them so unique. Hillsborough Fire Rescue has a new tool in its arsenal. In fact, it's got four of them. With these, we go to the fires. We don't wait for them to come to us. The Class 5 Skeeter brush trucks were put in service a few days ago, just in time for our region's peak wildfire season. A welcome addition for folks who live in parts of the county prone to flare-ups. Because I live close and it's important not only for me, but for anybody in that situation. The response will be quicker, right? It will be less danger to homes. And I think it would just give us a, a peace of mind. The vehicles built on a Ford F550 four door chassis are designed to get where other fire trucks can't, enabling them to reach smaller fires faster before they spread, powering their way through terrain like palmetto scrub and soft sugar sands where other trucks have trouble. We did our training in the same area that we had a large brush fire in last year, and we did have vehicles get stuck on that one. And same terrain, same area, same situation. No, no issues at all. Each of the Wildlands units is armed with a turret that can shoot water and foam, two firefighter hose lines, and a 400 gallon water tank, all controlled from inside the truck, keeping firefighters safer too. You won't have to be walking quickly to hit that fire. You can drive along at a higher rate of speed. We're not worried about turning ankles, the safety of our crew, getting stuck in mud, any of those things. Each of the four Skeeter trucks cost around $188,000. Hillsboro Fire Rescue actually traveled to Texas where they were assembled, customized, they say, to meet the specifications of our region. Hillsboro's new trucks replaced the last generation, which, it, which had reached the end of their lifespan at around 15 years. And while they are designed to fight brush fires, these new trucks, they say, can also help with fuel spills and other hazards where smaller-sized vehicles are especially useful.